Well, hey there team, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to some more Star Wars Squadrons. So, we had a look at the multiplayer, which I think is the sort of meat of this game, but I was really enjoying it. I, I actually quite like cockpit, cockpit? Cockpit fighters. <laughs> Even though I'm not a huge aeroplane enthusiast, I like video games where you dogfight and that sort of stuff. Um, anyway, so I wanted to come back and I thought, you know what, let's give the bit of the, the story a go. Let's re, re, what is this prologue? Prologue? After the destruction of Alderaan? No, whatever, just just give me the story. Restarting the story will reset the appearance of both your pilots. Whatever, I don't care. We're going to give the story a bill, and we're going to see what happens. And maybe it's a big old burning pile of shit. I can't remember. I don't remember it being terrible, but at the same time, I don't remember it at all. So I don't know. After Alderaan has destroyed something something. Meanwhile, fearless TIE fighters enforce the will of the Galactic Empire. Good! That's what they should do. The bloody fun police. Alright. Oh, face off. Alright, I get to I get to choose. I can be Taro Black Feather or uh, Arafo Cloudcutter. In Star Wars Squadrons, you will alternate between the perspectives of two pilots on opposite sides of the war. You will play as the Imperial pilot for your first mission. Oh, customize. Right, so I can change this dude's head, can I? Oh, goodness me. Legendary. Legendary. Why? why? I don't want legendary heads. Oh, <laughs> put your helmet back on, love. Holy shit. I don't know. Maybe I'll just go this bloke. Default Dan. Right? What's this? I can give him boobs? Well, there we go. It's 2022. Everything Nothing a game needs. Yeah, okay. Sure. Tarot Blackfeather. I guess I could randomize his name. It, except, I don't care. Whatever, these guys seem fine, right? They seem perfectly serviceable. Now, what's this? Choose your experience. Re standard, recommended. This setting enables HUD elements that help you in a variety of ways, such as by clarifying your current objective. Okay. Instruments only. This disables most standard HUD elements for a more immersive but more challenging experience. Onboard flight instruments for information. Fuck, that's actually really tempting. Um, let's just go... Can I change it during the game? Is that something I can change? I'm just going to go normal. Then what's this? Recommended for players with some experience in flight. Oh, that's me! I'm one of those players. Wait, what's veteran? Is veteran really hard? Recommended for players with lots of experience. Enemies more... De oh, whatever. We'll just start with uh, baby bitch mode. Note, your progress will automatically be saved. Yeah, that's fine. Whatever. Let's play. Bloody options inside options inside options. Interlinked. Um, a long time ago in a galaxy far. Oh, for crying out loud, this video is going to get struck so hard. You go, beep, beep. Oh, maybe not. Maybe we won't get copyright music. Oh, oh he says. <laughs> As that starts. Jesus. <laughs> the Alright, yeah, cool. Bang! Blow it up, mate. Exactly. God, so the, sometimes you just need a, a planet destroying laser. To spread dissent. Yeah. Find them. Those those aren't bad looking little, you know. Do not sperm ships. Until the destruction not, of Alderaan no. is complete. Right. Alright, so okay. Okay, because we're desperate to tie it into some sort of something. God help us if it was moderately original with the new Star Wars. Now we have to mop up the last 17 ships that got away from us blowing up. Never mind, not in a million years would they have seen the laser coming. There's no way they could have prepared to escape. Lord Vader's orders are clear. Are they? Yes. Wipe out all that remains of Alderaan. How? I understood the survivors were in hiding. Intelligence reports a possible Alderanian convoy heading to Fostar Haven. Alderanian, hey? You really stretching. You are to draw them out and finish them off. It's like Melbourne. You understand that, Captain? Perfectly, Commodore Sloan. Dismissed. It's pretty extreme. I'm just gonna go kill some poor convoy, like genociding. What? Maybe. You know what? I'll give the game benefit of the doubt. Maybe they'll explain why we're doing this. 
Because I'm pretty sure it was just a Darth Vader flex, right? He was like, hey, bitch, check this out. Bang! <laughs> I wiped out all these people. But, like, it seems unnecessary um, to fucking go and wipe out every last... Like, it also seems inefficient. And you. Who gives a shit? No qualms hunting down refugees from a world we destroyed? During the Iskalon uprising, you taught me to ignore propaganda. They're traitors, not refugees, and will be dealt with. Wait, Gordon ignore me. propaganda, she says, as I she submits herself Sigma to the propaganda. No. Only standard ties today. Flying old school, sir. This might be a real challenge after all. Whatever. Fucking Twitter user haircut. You hear me, Teresa? But I don't think you understand me. Mate, keep your voice down. She'll report you to HR. I guess we'll find out. Oh, I like this dude. He's kind of smooth. Except I gotta play as this fucking way. goober. And don't fire unless I give the order. The convoy is out there. We don't want to scare them off. Yeah. Let's do this right. Bugger. This guy seems like a fairly well acted, well captured, moderately well written character. He's probably gonna die in the first fucking Let's act. Show them how it's done. Oh, is that me? Is that my voice? I get to customize my car? No, I don't. I just get to get in it. Ooh! Apparently there is a... Begin check. Track IR these days. I should buy it. Systems. Bugger it. I might just order no it. Problem. Oh my god, this dude's voice. Yeah, press the buttons. Beep, 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 bop. I'm having issues with my VR setup at the moment. Up and running. I won't pair with my phone. <laughs> so I can't, I can't unlock it, which is killing me. So I have to order a new phone. God, I hate the future and technology. Alright, there we go. Tap on. But yeah, I, I'd try this in VR. Online and tracking. Board sensor online now, tracking. Throttle nice. Up and deploy out of the hangar. Throttle up. Let's go, baby. Um, that's literally what I'm pressing. Oh, you know what's going on? It's because I've re because I changed all my controls. Customize controls. Button assignments. Reset to default. We'll just do that, which is going to kill me because look how much work I've put into fucking fixing everything. And now the throttle still doesn't work. Really? Really? And now I've reset all my controls. Button assignments. Light. Reset to default. Done. It's alright, I'll have to learn everything. Oh god, oh god, it's taken off my inversion. Invert look. Invert flight. I don't know if... Invert look. We won't do that, but we'll invert flight. Throttle input mode. No, I want steps back. Let's do that. Whatever. Whatever. Don't fuck with the control, Scarlet. You're in a tutorial. Pull! Pull! Look at them! The rest of the fleet is back from Malastair. We'll have plenty of help to deal with that convoy of sympathizers. Helix Squadron. We're wow, they look cool. Transport. Stand by. Copy vigilance. All pilots follow me. Bum, brum, 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 brum. Controls. Absolutely. My dude's voice is too deep <laughs> for the head that he has. This is cool. I don't know if these ships have like six degrees of freedom in this game. I was thinking about it the other day. Because like... Uh, what would you call it? Terror-bound vehicles, like actual airplanes, don't have six degrees of freedom. They, they could not really. I mean, you've got VTOL systems and all that, but they're very limited. Stay mobile. We don't want any collisions. I 
I'm not really in formation, am I? I'm sort of cutting the formation in half. Oh, this is pretty cool. Oh, look at this. We're doing rolls, are we? Fucking you. From inside, you forget how big our Star Destroyers really are. You clogging comms, alright? This is official military channel. I don't want to hear about your bullshit Twitter posts. Oh. I guess maybe, uh... Oh, wait, hey, I, I was slowing down to stay in formation with this dude, but it seems he was slowing down to, for me to keep up. Flying so close to the hull is no time to get careless. The shields won't harm us. You're right, it sir. Is. It is good to fly old school again. Shut up, stop sucking up. There's something very forthright about a TIE fighter. My god, I, I hate you immediately so much. How can you have a fairly well-written and subdued character like the team leader dude, and also this Sheila who's insufferable? Maybe that's just how it has to be. You need one to cater to an audience of normal people, and one to cater to an audience of psychopaths. Throttle to half speed for better turns. Keep distance, Helix. Those engines run hot enough to vaporize a tie. I've known a few daredevils who found that out the hard way. Shut the fuck up! Tie pilots push the limits. Sometimes the limits push back. Oh, well, that's a dumb line. <laughs> it's spoken by my favorite character. Oh, that's a cool little, you know, skybox. Look at this. You can see the details inside its little bloody holes. Calibrated. The fleet is this is cool. We're pod racing now. Reports, our Gazanti transport is ready. Helix Squadron, head to the Gazanti and dock for hyperspace jump. Gazanti, right. Of course. Am I Helix Squadron, am I? Roger. Roger! Gazanti, so oh, look at these ships engaged. jumping away. Oh, 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 I'm locking on, baby! Invert or customize flight controls. Why would you tell me that now? <laughs> Who would fly through that whole thing without inverting if they had to? Remember, Helix, we'll have support, but finding the refugee convoy is up to us. They won't escape the Empire twice. How on earth are they not like glass viewports? Like, TIE Fighters look cool, but Jesus Christ, I, I'm not exactly a pilot, a ship designer. It's like... Maybe they could have made the window smaller than you can see. Maybe that would be better. Look at this! Yeah, that's cool. It's a TIE Fighter ship transport. Some sweaty pricks probably write me a paragraph down in the chat. Well, actually, it was an extended universe. A bloody uh, book 17 when they uh, had a fucking truce at Bakra ba or something. Center. Fuck, I don't know. It's only a haven for thieves and pirates. If the refugees are <sighs> hiding here, clearly they're not as innocent as they claim. Innocent they claim. What do you mean? Wow, look at this. Look at this fucking thing. This is cool. Oh, sorry, puppy. Man, it, it, it looks so good. I just, I just wish that the sm the screen was smaller. Interesting. There's a lot of cargo traffic today. You know? Our convoy might be hiding among them. Kind of feel like I can see too much. All cargo vessels. This is Captain Lyndon James of the Galactic Look at that Empire. Thing. Bloody Prepare mosquito, the uh, dragonfly looking thing. And this is Foster Haven Station Master. Kindly avoid harassing my customers. If they cooperate, they'll be fine. Yeah. Pilot, proceed. I'll handle it. I'll handle it. What am I handling? Sensor. I wasn't listening. Identify potential targets. Targets center of the sensor directly ahead of you. Pilot, begin by inspecting that ship. Oh. Oh. 
Ah, oh, then approach it. Your scan will begin automatically. A thousand meters. Wait, wait. Got it. We have always been loyal to the Empire. Doesn't matter if your scan comes up red, then you're dead. See? We're loyal. I swear. Yeah. Okay. Good. You're lucky this time, Not Andrew. Part of the convoy. Check another ship. Check another ship. Pilot, keep inspecting those ships and see if the refugees are here. Good. Check that ship next. Yeah. Well, don't pay anything. Just don't impound my ship. Oh yeah, check the shit out of your ship. Oh, you're lucky. No refugees aboard. Carry on. This one. You reckon we're gonna scan this one next? So you're not impounding my ship? Correct. There. A ship's trying to flee from <gasps> a simple inspection. We should teach them some manners. Should we? All pilots, bring your weapon systems online. Oh, there he is. Look, he's running! Track it on your sensors and fire a small volley. Just enough to damage them. Then see if they're hiding the refugees. Alright, alright. Scan us then. Just stop shooting. No refugees here, sir. Just smuggled weapons and a cargo of spice. Let the fleet handle those smugglers. We should get to the station. Okay, I guess we'll report it in. Press to cycle through targets. This is teaching the mechanics quite well, because I'm so rusty, man. <laughs> Dare I say, this is fun and a bum. My customers are legitimate traitors. You have no right. I have every right. I'm the Empire. The station's defenses just activated. Go on, then. Helix Squadron, destroy those turrets. We can't search under fire. Out here, no one shoots unless they're prepared for return fire. Even the Empire... What's the range on my gun? It's like a thousand... a thousand kilometers. A thousand meters. To divert powder lasers, press up. Lasers will recharge faster and hit harder. Oh, God. I get infinite repairs. Yeah, see how uh, we talked about this last episode. Let's see if I can customize it now because this will be interesting at the very least, right? Controls. I think what I did was change button assignment. I was quite happy with how I figured this out, right? So pitch up and pitch down. We don't want that. What we want is throttle increase and throttle decrease. Combo. What is this? Combo. Fire. Double tap. What is all this bullshit? Oh, you can dumb fire for a double tap. Oh, well, that's kind of cool, isn't it? Okay. So targeting. Okay. So my throttle. Is just increase and decrease, right? That's fine. I can understand that. Now, what was this? Throttle input, steps, and step increment. Now, if I recall, I might have done it to 50%. Use throttle friction. Throttle gauge moves slower through the center, making it easier to reach optimal maneuverability. No, I want frictionless control because I'm going to have set increments, right? Throttle down to stop boosting. You can turn off boost thrusters by throttling down. Yeah, that sounds sensible. Drift. Oh, I remember the drifting. Anyway, okay, let's see if this works. Okay. Perfect. That's perfect. That's exactly what we want. So you can see down the bottom left, if I press down once on my throttle, it puts it at max maneuverability in the center. And if I press down again, it puts it down to zero. 
yeah, look at that. That's cool. That's what we wanted. That's how I fly usually, so... So it's either, either we're going fast as fuck, or we're going max maneuverability. It's one or the other. Oh, X-Wings! Let's go! Ba -bam -bam. Shields. X Wings have regenerating shields. Blast through the shields. Okay. Lead your target. Okay. Enemy is down. Someone's tailing. The problem with this this chunk system is that I can't I can't slow to match pace. So I was out maneuvering him, but I was also out pacing him. And the only option there is to sort of feather it between throttle down and throttle up, uh, throttle throttle zero and maneuver. They think they can follow me. Bit of a soft lock. That half the rebel scum destroyed. Target destroyed. Yeah, I guess that's one way of doing it. Like I could divert power away from my engines to increase one of to decrease my overall speed, right? Seems like an infinite heals in this mode, which is cool. Joining formation. Rebel down. Nice. Rebel oh, it's fun, destroyed. man. Captain. Pretty light little skyboxes. After we'll them. With you later, station master. You attack my station and customers, then blame me, Imperial thugs. I'll oh, get over it, mate. We're in charge. We're the fun police. All right, there'll be no fun here. I'll write you a ticket. Been zapped. Sorry, Teresa. After all, Veron, I can't ignore what the Empire's become. Oh, Captain James! Sir. Linden, what are you saying? He's turning. That I don't care who ordered it. I didn't sign up to hurt innocent refugees. Fair enough. But they are rebel scum. Makes me a rebel. Then so be it. Damn it, pilot. See if you can bypass his shot. So great. So they take the good character away. Mash any button. That's how we bypass things. Catch up with that traitor. Great. So now they've, they've teamed me up vigilant. with the trasher character. James is aiding the rebellion. Send immediate assistance. Our chase. To divert power to him. I hope Let's go. Come to this. Missiles, watch out. Oh, he's probably invincible by the look of it. Oh, this is great fun. 
one of the best parts, like there was X-Wing and TIE Fighter games back in the day, right? But funnily enough, in the video game space, Star Wars, like, dogfighting is so underrepresented. I want to help Captain Javies. Goodbye, Teresa. Yeah, good. Oh, is Teresa gonna die? Please. Oh, am I gonna die? Maybe not. I'm not, I'm not exactly sure what just happened there. <laughs> That's a bit weird. Transition. Oh, now I'm bloody rebel scum. Look at those. Don't look like X-wings. They look like fancy bloody iPhone 14 X-wings. You know. I just want my iPhone 6. Does this dude have a ridiculously deep voice too? Hello there, yourself. Oh, okay, no. Bloody one of these things. Can anyone make out what he's saying? They're working on it. Okay, I got See, track IR in this because it's actually got canopy space would be pretty cool. Anyway, it's one of those things where I'm gonna have to stop you because I don't think I'm gonna have time to go through an entire mission. Which is a shame because I'm really enjoying this. I hope you're enjoying this too. Let me know if you are, and we will keep playing it. Um yeah. I'm sorry I poo-pooed the story. Uh I you know what? I I can sort of remember old bloody that annoying Sheila being in it um, and then taking away the good character. So I can see why it would miff me slash most normal people. <laughs> like, here's a good character and here's a trash character and we're going to we're gonna take the good one away. We're going to just tease you and go, hey, we can write good characters, but we're going to take this bloke away and now you're going to have to team up with the trasher. It's like, oh, fucking great, great. Anyway, Twitter, the game. Team, thanks again for joining me. I might just leave it there for the time being and I'll catch you guys on the next one. Yeah.